Yo, what is up guys? The Basic Brick here. Today gonna be playing some Team Fortress 2. I am invisible. Gonna be playing as the scout on Hell Train, which has become really my favorite map. Uh, that's that's someone. I was gonna say that's a spy, but everyone's invisible right now. I'm gonna probably mess it up and say invincible a few times, knowing me. You get fired. You're a pirate. Oh my god, why is the entire blue team there? And I, I finished both of them off. You know what? I'll take that. I'll take the three kills right there. Just join the round. It's just started. However, the flags have been captured twice. Or power cores. I don't know what they're actually supposed to be. They look like power cores or something like that. Kind of reminds me of a asteroid. Rest in peace, asteroid. But yeah, it's just going to be playing on Hell Train, which is definitely my favorite of the... Uh, six maps added. It's just the most crazy. It's Convoy Halloween Edition. It's, uh, it's cool. And I got ambushed by that pyro, however... Oh, Engineer. Yeah, he's, he's gonna kill me. <laughs> oh yeah, so on this map, uh, this just happens randomly. Not only does it put you in third person, which I think some other Halloween maps do. Oh, they'll do that with, like, the shrunken heads. No, this puts you in third person and just stretches you the fuck out. Like, you're a piece of Laffy Taffy, which I guess... I guess that's Halloween-themed. You know, it's like candy. I can't aim. Well, I can't aim, period. But I, I especially can't aim in third person in TF2. Especially not with hit scan. Maybe with projectiles, but, uh... Yeah, that, um... That's a goofy little, uh... Manipulation that happens on this map. Uh, this map is also way more crazy, like the actual skybox is way more crazy than I originally thought when I made my uh, Halloween intro, intro to the new Supreme Fortress update video. I thought it was just taking you across like a spooky train tracks, but no, it's crazy. It's called Hell Train. It takes you to hell, which we'll see uh, in a bit. Hopefully, we should. I don't know why we wouldn't. Oh, okay, well, we both uh, burned each other to death. Playing as a scout because it is capture the flag. However, I don't know if that's actually the best idea because there's gonna be sentries. Like I see in the kill feed, there's a sentry. It's capture the flag. Unfortunately, it's capture the flag map. Convoys capture the flag, so you're gonna make the spooky version of it. Capture the flag as well. But you know what? The map's too cool. I don't care. I mean, I kind of care, but I'll, I'll ignore it. Also, I got I got the hit on that NG. Oh, and the NG's dead. And the sentry gun... Nope! I I thought the sentry gun was down. I thought I saw in the kill feed that a sentry gun died, but there must have been a different one. So we're gonna have to wait. Or I guess we can switch classes, but I kinda wanna play some scout here. Maybe if I get annoyed enough, I'll like switch to demo man or soldier. I almost had that, because that, that engineer was dead. I don't know how the demo man killed him. He said he got killed by a bottle. I missed every shot, but it didn't matter, because I got a random crit. The one I did miss, insta kill them. Fucking mini sentries, man. Mini sentries aren't too much of a big deal anymore these days. Like, it's not 2013 pretty whenever they nerfed them. Not even nerfed them, they just fixed them. They were broken for a while. Or they would heal while building and you could just spam them. And then you could also pick up um, the metal from the destroyed ones to build a new one. It was uh, it was not a fun time to play Team Fortress 2, especially as a scout. 100% crit time, my favorite time. All right, so I think this means that the map will start getting all crazy now. It's already kind of crazy. You see the night, the desert, looks cool. Oh, are we in space or the desert? I can't even tell. I think we're meant to be in the desert. I can't tell if that's floating shit or just the skybox being buggy. And I think it's a buggy skybox. I don't know. We're in some cool blue area, though, right now. And, uh, that's a, um... Oh, no, you're real. Thank you, Medic. I know I'm not the power class you probably want, but... Pub Medic's gotta make do, alright? You know, Country Girl's gotta make do. Pub Medic's gotta make do. Oh, here we go. There's the portal. Alright, this is when shit's about to get, a. Uh, it's about to get crazy. Crazier than it already is. Our intelligence is being captured. That's not good. I want to keep playing on this map. What? No, we we're about to go to hell. See, look, we're in hell now. It's cool. Ugh. All right, we are going to be playing as a soldier now. We're gonna be on the blue team this time. Cause that's the team 
I got put on it. And it's not like you can change teams and pubs. You haven't been able to do that in 2016. That is crazy. That is something I really hate. Is that, uh... And I'm surprised they never changed that. Because casual uh, is really not that bad anymore. Man, was it fucking awful back in the day. Holy shit, it was, like, broken for, like, two years. And, uh, here's why we brought a shotgun. Because there's pyros on the other team. But I, uh... I didn't think quick enough. Also playing soldier, because I don't want to have to deal with sentries. I'd like to be able to play the objective and be able to actually do shit against sentry guns. Because they're not the worst things in the world, honestly. Like, they're not not the end of the world. At least not when you're playing as a soldier. They kind of are when you're playing as a scout. You kind of just... Did that guy just walk at me and press the fucking killbind button? He did. What the fuck is that? Also, I'm missing every shot, so let's pull my shotgun. Uh, I don't know if the shotgun's the right move here, considering this map's got a lot of verticality to it. But hey, it's got spooky spells that can do the job for me without taking any uh, any health away. And I got a medic, so that definitely helps. We're gonna go up to the intelligence room and steal the intelligence, and there's probably a spy chasing us. There's also, yep, probably a sentry gun. Oh, it's... Okay, third person. Not the... Not ideal. Oh, it's the stretchy third person. Does it actually shoot at the stretchy part of your body? No, it doesn't. And the rockets still come out of the center of your screen. <laughs> this is such a fucking... Oh, it's such a weird effect, man. It's tripping me out. The first time I saw this, and I wish I got my reaction of it. Unfortunately, it wasn't while I was making that video. Because if it was, that, that would have been great. But my first reaction to this was just off, off the thing. I was so confused, and I was laughing my ass off. Stretchy ass taffy polar soldier. Nice stair stab, buddy. Oh fuck, this might actually kill me. Damn it! Okay, hopefully my team can uh, pick up the slack. It's literally above us. Engin engineer, there's the intelligence is right in front of you. What the fuck are you doing? You're just watching it go. Okay, well at least we picked it up now. I think we go this way. Yeah, we go this way. It's like it's opposite of the other, the other one. All right. Let's go, let's cap the point. I do not play Capture the Flag ever, so I'm not used to doing this. I don't think I've played Capture the Flag regularly since, like, 2013, when I was 12 years old and I thought Capture the Flag was a good game mode. I don't even know if I thought it was a good game mode. That was just kind of the only game mode. Also, <laughs> fucking invisibility. Uh, that's uh, great. Also, I got the Mouse Trap spell, which is the goofiest spell. That medic is going to try to steal Uber from me. He's going to try to take my health, convert it to Uber. Ah! Oh, my man rocking the fly outfit. Really the only reason I would want to play Engineer during this time. is for the fucking fly cosmetic. It's amazing. You go away, spy. <laughs> I think I blew him up. Oh, shit. Pyro. Medic. No. Why do you run? Why do you run away from me? Not towards me, I could have killed him for you. This is so sad. Again, the fucking third person, as fun as the spell is, third person aiming is just not my strong suit. It's not as bad with projectiles, but I'm still... Yeah, like, see, I, I just can't do that shit, man. I think, uh, train's about to be transported to another dimension. Where are we now? We are, uh, no, we're not. We just, we're outside again. That's boring! I want to go to hell, which I'm probably going to anyway for the many sins I've committed. Ah! It scared me. I think our intel is being stolen. I gotta go stop that. Oh, there's the portal. Okay, maybe I want, I want to stay out here for that. I don't care if the, our uh, intelligence gets captured. I want to show... My audience, the cool feature in this map. Some guy's gonna come over and ruin it for me, though. I can just feel that. I can feel it. And yeah, no, goddamn, we got teleported to fucking New Mexico. Or whatever. Not hell, but I guess they're kind of the same thing. That's actually a joke. New Mexico, I think, is a fine state. Get destroyed. Ah! Another pyro jump scare. Oh my god. <laughs> this guy's fucking. I think his name checks out. Skin Lesion. He does look like he has some sort of foul skin condition. Ugh. That's one nasty pyro cosmetic. 
I do say so myself. And we lost? What? We lost again before going to hell. I want to have a chat with the red team here, okay? I'm kind of getting sick of the round ending before I get to go to hell. Like, come on, man. I want to go here. Please let me get behind someone. God damn it! He, he had no health. He had no health. A second attempt at doing a cool fancy trick off the uh, off the launch pads here. Maybe we can get behind this pyro. Maybe. Yes, I can. <laughs> this map is a lot of fun. It, it's it's got everything you could want. It's got a train. It's got hell. It's got cool skyboxes. It's got all sorts of spooky shit. It's a moving map, and it's got platforms you can jump between sides. Only downside is the capture flag map, honestly, and that going to hell isn't quick enough. So I want to go to hell immediately, okay? A couple days after I released my video, I actually met one of the guys who created the map, and I'm forgetting his name. Um, sorry about that. That was like a week ago. Probably actually over a week ago now. Uh, so I don't remember the guy's name. Oh, and here we go. We're stretching again. But yeah, he was like, he, he recognized me, and I was like, oh my god, like, yeah. He was like, are you, based, are you the YouTuber? I'm like, yeah, but I got like 400 subs, I'm not big. He's like, oh, I saw your video on the map. I say this all, by the way, while I'm missing every shot on that fucking demo, man. That was really sad. But then that didn't happen. Just just listen to me talk, okay? But yeah, and they said, uh, they, they saw my video on the map, and I was like, yeah, this map rocks, so... That was pretty cool. It's like the first time I've been recognized in TF2 ever, which is pretty neat. Okay, we're gonna go back to playing Soldier, because apparently I can't play any other class. Which I guess is typical for somebody who's most hours are on Soldier. That guy just got launched, by the way. That was awesome. I love... I love ragdolls, man. I'm so glad I can play with them. No, oh, stole my... Stole my spellbook. My spooky spellbook. I've, like, deleted a lot of footage, probably, if you're watching this, because, uh, I was just dying a lot. I was gonna say, though, I don't want to spoil it, but, uh, the cool part of the map is you go, like, to the underworld, to hell, and then there's, like, this giant-ass drop you go down, and then there's, like, I don't know, there's, like, a crazy-ass spiral thing, kind of reminds me of Beetlejuice in a way, I don't know, it's cool. It's a cool, um, it's a cool map. I've said that probably a million times. Are we going down the spooky- Oh, yep, we are! We are! We're going down it! I'm dead! Are you fucking kidding me? I'm dead for the cool... Vertical drop. Come on, I want to go outside. Of course it happens when I fucking die. Alright. But here we are now. This is what I mean by the Beetlejuice thing. We go through that tunnel. Now we're going straight up. And, uh, if you have motion sickness, I am sorry. This is awesome, though. Now we're upside down. We're doing loop-de-loops. I'm gonna pickaxe you. I'm dead for all this, because I'm playing, like, absolute garbage. And, uh, yeah, that's the cool part of the map. It's, like, the carousel... Not carousel. Music park in hell. Um, and now we're back at the, the cool village thing. Um, I'm probably gonna end the video here right now, though, because, uh... I was doing all right in the beginning, but now my, my gameplay is absolute dog shit, because I've just been focused on, like, talking about random shit. And trying to uh, show you guys the cool part of the map. Ironically, that ends up getting me killed. And then the cool part of the map happens while I'm dead. Which uh, isn't how I planned it. So you know what? I may just end up including an actual video of the cool part of the map interrupted right here. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe. Dislike it if you dislike it too. I'm the basic brick and I'm out.